Now at 632, we are tracking the COVID vaccine on your morning rush. The next phase of the rollout has started, so that means tens of thousands of people who are 65 and older are looking to register for a vaccine. The process has been confusing for some folks. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Caitlin Nuclo is live in Bristol this morning where you can get some help today. Good morning, Kate. Good morning, Wendell. Good morning, Nicole. Yeah, this is a big group of people who are now eligible uh, to get the vaccine. So if you've been having a little bit of trouble registering online, we can stop by the American Legion here in Bristol today, and there'll be folks from Bristol Health here ready and willing to help you. Bristol Health will have three employees present at the event today to help register folks. This all comes as the vaccine rollout has recently opened up for people 65 and older, many of them anxiously waiting for their turn. Meanwhile, we also now know who will be eligible next. The group includes those with high risk conditions and essential workers like teachers and grocery store employees. But there is still not a concrete answer on when they will be able to schedule. Give us a couple of weeks. We're talking to CDC. Um, I'm on with the head of the uh, uh, COVID task force in the White House yesterday just to get a, a little more guidance in terms of how we want to do it. All right, so if you need a little bit of help, you can stop by here from 10 to 1 today. We are live in Bristol. I'm Caitlin Nuclo, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.